what is up you guys so I got the tires or the wheels all loaded up um, we're actually getting new tires but we're heading over to discount tire uh, it's just the closest tire shop I have where I live um, but I'm gonna drop them off there and then just have them take off the tires and I'm gonna order some new ones while I'm there as well and boom just like that we got the wheels back um, so now he's gonna prep them and get them all nice and clean alright first step for anything that you ever want to paint is you get them clean so that's what we're gonna do now Wet. Basically, spray them down, get them all nice and clean. I use PDF, brake, brake buster. Same thing to the back. up here but now I'm gonna hit it with an iron remover as you can hear the light the thunder in the back bro it's raining yeah I know started raining so I mean I got this one all nice and cleaned up I saw some of the the glue right there and a little bit more spots to hit but probably gonna wait until it stops raining so it's the next day I got the wheels for the most part pretty clean I'm gonna scruff them up right now with a uh, scruffing pad That literally hurts to do. <laughs> so that's what I'm just gonna do this whole tire wheel, just scrub them up. Well, I forgot to record most of it it just it took me a lot longer than what I expected but I got them all scuffed down they're wet right now I right, just rinsed them off real quick and I used that degreaser to to clean them up a little bit better but tomorrow 
I will go ahead and just rub it down with alcohol and then start painting. So that will be for tomorrow, but I'm going to end up going to sleep now because I got work in the morning. So that shall be for tomorrow. <sighs> it got sand in it. Well, as you can see, um, it's still dark. Um, I ended up working uh, until super late and I fell asleep and I still haven't touched these. It's literally been chilling in my front yard for two days now. So, so I got the adhesive off and everything. This thing actually works really, really well. So I 10 out of 10 recommend. Um, I'm gonna grab some alcohol, rubbing alcohol. Just wipe down the barrel. And really, just everything. Shit. And I'm using the Rust-Oleum Automotive Primer. First coat I used to do really light, and then the second coat I used to go heavy because trying to rush this but just a nice little but after that like I guess I'd really like coats just for the first one I didn't do this because you're not gonna see it so I'm not gonna waste my time to do it and then from here it over okay it's been like five ten minutes uh, to let it dry now I'm just gonna hit it with a second coat and yeah this one's gonna be heavier uh, probably just do two coats and call it good. Now we'll do the inside. Just like that, all done. So, let this dry for a bit. Only thing I'm running issues is, we have a lot of bugs out here, and they keep getting in here. But, like I said, I don't really care that much anymore. So, we shall just roll with it. Okay, so, uh, Wheels are all painted. I got them all drying over there. This one's been sitting for like half an hour now. Uh, but now we're just gonna go ahead and paint it with the Rust-Oleum, uh, what is it, gloss white. And then Four I really can't mess up. I really can't. No! Zoom in right here. I accidentally did too much. Oh well. There's really not much you can do about it. I mean, you can try and wipe it off. I think that just makes it look even worse. But we're gonna try it out. You just have to make sure you do it. Okay. Hopefully just no one <laughs> looks at my wheels too closely. Close. Imagine if you had DBSs. For real, that'd be a freaking nightmare. There it is. 
Like I said, sick. got some right there, but I don't think it really matters. I'm gonna hit these, but I'm gonna hit them after. And then we're gonna better. Damn. Okay. First coat's on. I'm gonna leave this. So, actually, I'm gonna do the lift here real quick. Boom, just like that. I really hope that the spray paint doesn't affect the sensor, but oh well. Let's see. So with this, um, I'm gonna go ahead and do the rest, and we'll follow up again once I'm ready for primer. I'm gonna do two coats, maybe three. Depends on how much I have. I probably only have enough for two, but yeah. All right, so last part, just have to hit it with the clear coat. I'm using the Dupli color 1K clear coat. So yeah, same thing as last, all the other steps. Literally spray on. So yeah, basically just do that all over again. I'm gonna do two coats. Once I'm done with those two coats, I'm going to let them dry overnight and then I'll show you the end result in the morning. looking at this <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and put all the other ones on and lower the car looks so oh with the green caliper this is just so nice so I'm gonna go ahead and do the other ones right now Literally trying to rain. 